So as we look at creating a super insulated envelope, that means the walls, the roof, the ceiling, and below our slab. So in a traditional basement slab, we're gonna have anywhere from about two to four inches of insulation. With a passive house, we tend to dial that up. So on this house, we have about nine inches of reclaimed foam insulation. And we're trying out a new assembly here that Steve Basic came up with. Steve Basic's a, a passive architect, high performance architect that we follow. Steve did something very innovative with a basement setup, which is he actually removed the concrete from the slab. So for hundreds of years in New England, we're used to having dirt floors in our basements. At a certain point, we started pouring concrete slabs to kind of hold the walls. But our foundation walls now actually aren't held in place by the slab. They're actually held in place by the rebar. So by removing the concrete slab in this basement, we've done two things. One, we've reduced the amount of embodied carbon that is in that concrete. And two, we've created a much softer floor. So if you're in a gym space or if you have a home gym or a home office where you're pacing a lot, you're gonna get a really soft floor. So this floor's got a lot of give in it, which is great. So kids' playrooms, a lot of kids' dens or playrooms down the basement. This floor really has some bounce to it. It's almost like a dance floor in a professional dance studio.